channel for today videos is bird hunting, boo hunting, and fox hunting. Yeah, <laughs> fox hunting with some luck. You'll see that later. Yep. These are called sandpipers in English or shorebirds. Some bird watchers even call them peeps. But on the Johnson travel journey, we're always hunting something, right, honey? Yep. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. We forgot to bring our bug spray. Yeah. Oh, look. Oh, the Pugo, you mean? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, you're flying. Look. Yet it's the shorebird migration. They're coming down from Canada and Alaska. Some of them are going all the way to South America, honey. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> they stop to get... Um, they stop to eat... Um, hopefully mosquitoes, but... Um, yeah. <laughs> cacaine... Um, um, ca cacaine... Uh, Doming... Uh, Stabbing bugs, um, Gustang to Ba. <laughs> yeah. Nice waves. So this is Port Mahan. <laughs> Those are horseshoe crab uh, shells that are upside down there. That's why it smells fishy. It smells below, right? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Those are horseshoe crab shells. Well, ready to explore the road a bit further? Yes. Okay, let's go. Yep, it's dead. Oh. It's been dead so long, it's even growing mold along the sides. This is why it smells like fishy, like Easter Nakapop Lok. <laughs> this is a horseshoe crab. So that dead horseshoe crab, there's a lot of living ones, especially in May and in May and June, they lay their eggs. So they come, uh, all the, all the birds, the sandpipers, or, um, in the Philippines, they say Pugo, coming up from South America to have babies in Canada, like to eat the, um, eat log nanga, uh, alimanga, um, caballo. <laughs> Zapata, caballo, I'm, uh, it doesn't make any sense, right? Yeah. The horseshoe crab. You can see there's a one flipped over right there. So as you can see, one of the Pugo was not like the others. He's standing still there. That one that just moved in the middle, that's a plover. Has a band across the front of its... The rest are sandpipers. So that plover just jostled its wings. Yep, right there. So the art of Pugo hunting requires picking out subtle differences. So zoom out. Zoom back in. That one in the middle that's walking and not flicking its wings, that's a plover. He has a bit of a black band in the middle, and if he gets too close to one of the other ones, you'll hear a peep and like defend its turf. I just saw one try to buck in. Mostly sandpipers though. Nice looking bird, that plover. I think it's a semi-palmated plover, but I'll have to look on eBird or Mer Merlin. Whereas those are sandpipers. Those are hard to tell apart. You need to like have powerful spotting scopes. Those are like binoculars. Um, those are like one lens binoculars that can magnify like hundreds of times. That's the future of the Johnson travel journey, them spotting scopes, powerful lenses to see the subtle differences between the Pugo or the Sandpiper, we say in English. So this is 
apparently an old fishing port or it's just surrounded by wetlands now. That's why it's so good for bird watching. And it's funny thing is the telephone poles are in the middle of the road. See a fishing pier out there. So there's a fishing pier here, and I think there might be a working fishing boat pulling in right there, or just sitting there, but. Rehoboth Beach, Bethany Beach, Ocean City, Maryland further down. Shout out to Ocean City, Maryland. Might go duck hunting for the went there for the winter, honey, right? Yes. <laughs> Christmas tradition, duck hunting in Ocean City. Yeah. <laughs> but um that's like at least a hundred kilometers down the coast. This is all wetlands and Little fishing ports, perfect for birding though. This is gonna take us. Yeah, you know, there's a salt marsh out there. And I'm out of the wind, the mosquitoes are kicking up, so maybe this is not such a good idea, Mr. Johnson. Honey, let's get out of here. The storm is coming. Back to the hotel, back to the hotel. Come yeah. on. <laughs> okay, well, the cell's ready because Monkey Duck wants to live for her. Uui saw North Carolina when we go to Savannah, Georgia for my sister's wedding, which will be its own Johnson Travel Journey episode. Right, Monkey B? <laughs> Come on, Tauntai, let's get out of here! <laughs> Dear but you're right. Tama! Okay, well, we saw a yellow throat back in there, but um, couldn't get a good video. We'll have to go yellow throat hunting some other time. Peace out, Port Mahan. <laughs> <laughs>